Hey guys, Chris from 6++ here, and we are now a quarter of the way through the year. Can you believe it? Well, I thought I would take this opportunity to sort of talk about the things that we have done so far this year, and then actually tell you guys what we've got planned for the future. We are, of course, primarily a battle report channel, um, but in COVID times, that's not quite so easy to do. Um, UK lockdown laws have meant we've managed to film one or two games with um, support bubbles in place, but other than that, it's, kind of, it's, not, it's been a no-go, really. Um, so we've had to think of different ways of producing content to kind of keep you guys sticking with us. Um, so obviously we did try the Me VI series, um, and that was quite rewarding, actually, because it was good fun to play. Um, it meant we got to try out lists and just play Warhammer, and as we know, more Warhammer is better than less Warhammer. Um, but it was also quite nice to hear that you guys were actually taking this idea on board and thinking, oh, actually, it does work if you want to play yourself and try it out. So I know not everyone has wanted to take on Tabletop Simulator. Um, so yeah, if you haven't played against yourself yet, give it a go, because it's actually quite good fun. We started introducing some painting videos, um, very fortunate Ben is a Seed Studios painter, um, so it's been great that he's brought on his kind of expertise to the channel and there's plenty more where that came from. Um, Lee and I obviously also paint um, to varying degrees of success, but we've got some handy hints and colour schemes and those will be videos that come out soon enough because I think sometimes it's nice just to try and pick up on different methods and different techniques and which aren't always necessarily focused on um, super high quality if you're just trying to knock out some different schemes. I know at the moment I'm currently working on a video for um, Necrons which is all about that kind of that bronzed um, old metallic look and um, yeah I think those sorts of things are um, something we're going to try and bring out more and more of in the future. From Great to Greatness is obviously uh, a big video series we started right at the end of last year in which I'm kind of tracking my building of an admech force and Lee is tracking his kind of greater demon monster mash army um, primarily based around Slaanesh um, and you know we kind of use this as an opportunity to spend more money and build an army but also really show you guys the process and have you along for the ride. Um, obviously the videos started off quite regularly and they've kind of died off as you know you get different interests and that sort of thing but they will still carry on over the course of the year. Um, for me obviously Admech are coming out very shortly so that's meant that I've just suddenly started up my painting again of Admech because I did get distracted with Space Marines and Lee's currently distracted with Death Guard uh, but I know he'll be coming back and kind of sharing various things too. Product reviews are another string to our bow as well. It all started out when we got in contact with Urban Mats. They sent us some stuff. We've reviewed it. We've got more reviews of that coming. Um, and I think, you know, there are so many pieces of scenery, terrain, um, resources, equipment out there in, in the Warhammer world. There's actually not that many reviews of them. And sometimes, you know, in an already expensive hobby, you want to know how to... Um, splash the cash so that will certainly be something we're going to be um, carrying on doing and it won't just be urban mats um, I have an A case the magnetic case on the way I'm going to be reviewing that soon so yeah it will, if there's things you want reviewed and things you can recommend then obviously let us know and we might be able to get hold of those and um, give you our thoughts on them so in terms of what we've done that kind of covers the first three months they've been pretty busy um, you know our subscribers are steadily increasing too we're up to at the time of recording over 750 um it feels like generally a new battle report manages to bring in over 50 subscribers a video so we're nearing that almighty 1000 where um We'll then start bringing in all the pennies, which, you know, that's obviously the reason we're doing this for the money. So that's pretty exciting. But um, obviously we need to talk about the future because there's so much still to come. So, of course, the main thing, battle reports, we'll be back with more. Um, lockdown ends in about a month at the time of a recording in terms of legally being able to play games. So that's very exciting will be able to use the full variety of armies. We've obviously had a lot of painting time, so there'll be some very different things on show. 
how regularly we can get them out, who knows, but that will still be our driver. Um, we're still working on the style and substance of our battle reports. I think we're starting to get to the stage where we're quite happy with um, the formula we have for them, although if there's anything you would recommend, then please always do let us know. Um, but yeah, I think we've kind of spent the first six months of our existence um, working out what we want to do, and we're kind of there now. Um, so yeah, more battle reports is a given. We have just started um, doing some tactics and tips videos, and there's a lot more where that came from. I have a whole list on my phone of things I want to cover. Um, you know, they're always going to be aimed more at the beginner intermediate player rather than the advanced, but I do think that a lot of the things we talk about are quite good refreshers for um, more advanced players as well. Um, so yeah, those will keep coming. You know, it's going to be stuff, anything from managing your CP to preparing for a tournament and all the steps in between. Um, I've managed to get someone on board to help me film a learn to play series, um, which is gonna be good fun. Um, yeah, we've got a whole host of different videos for tips and tricks and tactics, so that'll be really cool. Um, again, as I said previously, painting guides, um, I think they're always really interesting. Ben will be able to do a great job on those with Lee and I supplementing them to the best of our ability. And perhaps most excitingly for, well, some of us, the more competitive ones, it will soon be tournament season. Uh, Lee and I already booked onto two tournaments, two weekends after each other in July, one of which is a team tournament. So we've got two other guys joining us for that. Um, and that's gonna be really good fun. And the idea for that is we'll be talking about our list building, what we're taking. We'll then go to the tournament. We'll do like kind of a vlog whilst we're at the tournament, um, talk through our games, and then we'll do a debrief afterwards. And um, yeah, we'll be able to share those with you. And I think that will hopefully show you what tournaments are all about. And if tournaments are something you haven't done before, you'll get to see that actually they're not that big a deal and they are just really good fun. Even booked into a 220 player tournament in February next year. So that's pretty exciting. Um, and from a personal note, we've got the ADMEC. That's the army I'm going to be focusing on. I've been waiting to see when the Codex would come out. I've not really been enjoying the Necrons too much, to be honest. Um, I've kind of, I've tried the Swarm. I've tried the Transcendent Catan Blob. Um, I've got vehicles to go, so that's something maybe I'll try in a battle report. But other than that, I think the Admech are where it's going to be at for this season. So I'm looking forward to taking them on board. Lee is smashing life with his Death Guard. And um, I'm sure he's going to be a terror on the tournament scene with them. Um, we've got Ben, who um, has just bought two Dimacarans. So that's going to be fun to play against. Paul, who's been on the channel before. 35 Deathwing Terminators. Yeah. You're going to see a lot of fun stuff on the channel in our battle reports and you'll be hearing about them a lot um, in the tournaments and all that sort of thing too. So there you go. That's just a very quick rundown of sort of the things that we have done and where we're going to be going. If you enjoy the channel, please recommend us to other people. Um, word of mouth is huge. Um, there are a lot of battle report channels out there but the reason well you're watching this video because you enjoy watching our content right so please do tell your friends share our videos as they come out um it does help us a lot and it makes us feel warm and fuzzy inside which is the most important thing so yeah thank you very much for joining as always if you have any thoughts or tips or tricks or anything you want to see in video please do just let us know in the comments come join us on the facebook page all that jazz. We've got an Instagram page as well. It's all the same stuff, 6++ Gaming. It's all linked everywhere. You can find us very easily. Um, on our Facebook and Instagram page, we post more pictures and just general stuff like that rather than just the videos. So, uh, yeah, come and join us. And uh, that's all for me. Take care.